Hey everyone, welcome to a quick tutorial on how we can create custom transitions. First things first, you'll want to head over to your file system and open up the add-ons folder. Then, inside the scene manager, you need to find that folder called transition library. Now, inside that folder, we're going to add a new scene. When that create new scene pop-up appears, click on the little button that has the tree icon. In the search bar that comes up, just type transition and select the transition node. Save the transition scene. This is going to create a brand new scene that includes a couple of super important child nodes. We've got an animation player and we have two dummy scenes, A and B. You can think of these as virtually representing your target and current scenes. So, listen up. These specific nodes are absolutely mandatory. You have to keep them. The same goes for the transition animation itself and this one specific call method track in the animator, which I'm showing you right here. But here's the cool part. Everything else is totally up to you. Feel free to change the animation duration, add any tracks you want, toss in some shaders, you name it. Let's quickly run through an example. In your newly created transition scene, the first thing we'll do is resize those dummy nodes. Let's reset the anchor preset to full rect so they take up the whole screen size. As you can see here, we already have a basic transition to work with. Next, in the animation player, remove all the tracks except for that mandatory call method track we talked about. Then, select your current scene node and go to Visibility to add a key on Modulate. Uncheck this box as we don't need Reset Animation. Down in the Animation Timeline, you'll add another key at the end of the animation. For this key's value, set the Alpha to 0. Let's change the ease value for a smoother transition. Now, play the animation. As you can see, we've got a smooth fade-out transition between scene A and scene B. Save the transition scene. Time to test it out. Click on the Scene Manager tab to open up your Scene Manager. Add two new nodes and assign a scene to each of them. Then add an out slot and connect them. Finally, make sure to select your newly created transition and save everything. Now run your project and watch your brand new transition in action.